Hi, beautiful souls. It's Tan back here again today with you and this Astrology, Human Design, and Jinkies channel. And I am super excited today because I have a big announcement for you guys. And that is that our human design course has officially been launched. I want to share a little bit more about what this course is all about and what you guys will get out of this course if you do enroll with us. So this human design course is a course that I had planned with Cindy, who is a human design guide. She is certified by Karen Curry Parker, and we have been planning and working together on this course. She's also part of the facilitators of our hyphen soul community and also on the Tan Astrology team. So yeah, we have been working together to build a First, we were thinking of building like a basic human design course, but as we really got into it, the course got pretty deep and it's not really such a basic human design course anymore. But basically, what we wanted to bring to you guys in regards to this online human design course is this idea of unbecoming. So the course is mainly focused on what's well, focused on a lot of things and I'm going to share the little details about it with you real soon but the fundamentals of the course is basically to bring you back into your natural self through the process of unbecoming so it's this unbecoming of who you think you should be unbecoming who you thought your parents wanted you to be unbecoming who society expects you to be and in that process of unbecoming, returning back to your natural self, the the you that would make you the most happy with everything in life. And why do we want to share this particular wisdom with you guys? You see, when you unbecome, we can say into your natural self, what ends up happening is that you become more creative. And so I want to introduce you guys to the idea of fundamental creativity versus situational creativity. So situational creativity is not sustainable. And that's the kind of creativity where we have been conditioned to use for a large part of our life. That's when, you know, when you have problems that comes into your life, we tend to go back to the mind to look for solutions, or we tend to look back to what we already know the patterns that we have already learned in our life to help us solve a particular problem in our life, whether that is relationship problems, career problems, spiritual problems, or even life purpose problems. And this type of situational creativity is built based on who you think you are, based on your family, your society, your past. When you go on this human design course journey with us, and you go through this process of unbecoming into your natural self, you will begin to unlock what is called fundamental creativity. And this is creativity that is sustainable. So when you're presented with problems in your life, what fundamental creativity allows you to do is see possibilities beyond the mind and possibilities beyond anything that you have ever thought was possible in your life. So, you know, I can give you a little bit of my experience with situational and fundamental creativity because before I discovered human design, before I really learned into my type, which is a projector and my strategy, which is wait for the invitation and my authority, which is emotional authority and my line, which is a one, three and and so on and so forth. I was stuck in like this thought, this idea that I needed to work in, you know, the corporate world and make that kind of stable monthly income. And whenever I was faced with problems in my life, for example, when I was burning out or when I was having health issues or when I was just coming home every day and crying because I felt like, you know, this job was taking the life out of me, I didn't know what to do. I just continued to stay in it because I thought, you know, my my situational creativity only gave me solutions to this problem that was limited and it was in a box. So the solutions I had at that point was, for example, to take a holiday, to go on vacation, to travel so that I can escape and release all of the stress that I was having. And I was going this loop of seven days a week feeling stressed. And then one time a month or maybe once in every two months, I would go on a holiday. And so I was in this cycle of using my mind to think that this is the way to solve this problem because that's what my parents told me. That's how I grew up. But once I discovered about human design, I learned more about it. Then I begin to begin to develop my 
fundamental creativity. So I began to think outside the box. I began to stop that cycle of just taking a holiday and see my life as a holiday, you know, see my life as a new kind of adventure. So it's this paradigm shift, this ability to break patterns that helps me to live a more fulfilling life, that helps me to be happier every day, not burn out, and just feel like I'm coming back to my natural self. I'm returning to the natural self through this process of unbecoming. And this is what we want to bring you in this human design course. So it is an online human design course and it is completely self-paced and you will have access to it for a whole year. And I'm going to show you what is involved in terms of the details of this human design course. Okay, so if you visit our website, hyphensoul.com, you will come across a tab that says courses. You'll see that Discover Your Blueprint is our not so beginner or basic human design course. Once you enter into that course, you will see that what we're offering in this course is going through your centers, the different energy centers in your body. We go through the different types in human design. We um, talk about the lines, your strategy, your authority, circuitry, your incarnation across. We have a little worksheet for that for you. We even go into the environment, the cognition, and the determination, which is why it's not so basic in human design anymore because that um, is actually something that is quite advanced in human design, but we've brought it to you in a way where it's going to be really easy for you to understand what kind of environment is best for you, how you digest food, and what's your superpower, which is your cognition. So you will be receiving 39 human design teaching videos, nine hours total video from me and Cindy. You have one incarnation cross worksheet, which is inside a basic human design course workbook that is about 150 pages or more. Um, and in the workbook, we offer contemplation questions. We have things that you can kind of make notes with, fill in the blanks, something you can have fun with if you are more of the, you know, the, the type that needs to write. But of course, we also have those videos if you are the more, you know, auditory learners. And they go together. So at the end of each video lesson, we will ask you to go back to your human design workbook so that you can also make contemplations, notes and journal things down. And you also get um, your human design body graph as well, which is the body graph that we would like to invite you to use as you go through the course. So we begin the course with setting intentions together because that is like the most important thing is if you don't know why you're doing this course, then it would be kind of, it would seem kind of like purposeless as you go through it. We also go through the different mechanics of human design and just the basics of that. And then of course, we go through each of the energy centers and through each of the energy centers, we talk about each center and how it is when it's defined and undefined and how you can get in touch with your each energy center for you, whether you have a defined, undefined, or open so that you can unbecome who you thought you should be that is not aligned with your energy center. So we have all the centers here and then we go through each of the energy types. So we look at the energy types as being a particular role that you may take on in the world. And when you are unbecoming, you are unbecoming the role that maybe you thought or your family or your, your past taught you that that is the role that you have, but it's actually not your role so that you can unbecome to your natural self. And then, of course, we go into strategy and authority, which is one of the most important things that we feel you need to understand about human design in order to unbecome your natural self, unbecome towards your natural self. So we also include the circuitry in human design in there as well, which will allow you to understand more whether you have more individual energy or tribal or collective energy and to unbecome who you maybe thought that you should be like, if you're more individual, but there's shame around being an individual and you feel like you will have to use your energy for family and for tribal energy, which is not really in alignment with your actual body. And then we go through the digestion, the digestion or determination, your environment, so that these are, I we feel like the digestion, the environment and the cognition are more practical things that you can actually do to help you be unbecome to your natural selves easier. So it's kind of like practical steps that helps you to get back in the body so that you can embody your natural self, we can say. 
So that is the basics of our human design, not so beginner course to unbecoming your natural self. So yes, do visit our website, hyphensoul.com under courses. This is available for you. Now I have a special offer for you guys here as well. It's if you would like to access this course for free, along with a Gene Keys library that we are currently building as well, we've got Gene Key for gene key four done for that but we're still continuing with other gene keys and you can access this human design course and the gene keys library for free if you are a hyphen soul member so as a hyphen soul member you will be able to of course get these courses for free but also participate in monthly we should say four times a month master classes and workshops online for free as well so let me just um show you guys what I'm talking about here. So we are offering memberships now. So under memberships, you will find that that we are currently building an online cosmic tribe. And that will that can only happen when you are part of the hyphen soul member. So we highly recommend there's different kinds of memberships that we offer, but we highly recommend the yearly membership because not only do you save a lot by that membership but that's the one where you get the human design course for free and our gene keys library access for free and then you'll be able to also attend four master classes and workshops every month so we've already done one this month we have three upcoming these master classes and workshops will be around gene keys human design astrology and how you can align your life purpose using astrology human design and gene keys as well as full moon circles every month and then we also have guest speaker events so these are very exciting master classes and workshops and circles and ceremonies that are not only intimate which means that you'll be able to connect more with other people who are like-minded and connect more with me sarah and cindy but it's also for you to transform and grow together with us so that you don't feel so alone in this transformation journey that you're going through and where we can bloom together into this journey of unbecoming to our natural selves. So that's going to be it for what I would like to bring to you guys today. I hope that you guys will take your time, you know, to consider this if you are an emotional authority. Otherwise, go for it. Listen to your body and see what your body tells you. If it's feeling excited about this, then go ahead and looking forward to sharing more of this beautiful journey of unbecoming with you guys. All right. Have a lovely day, beautiful souls. Bye.